Tajin Arvin Chanderpol is a cricketer. He was born on May 31, 1996 in Georgetown, Guyana. In October 2019, he was named in Guyana's squad for the 2019-20 Regional Super 50 tournament. He is the eldest son of West Indies batsman Shivan Arvin Chanderpol. He played the role of cricketer Larry Combs in the Bollywood film 83. In October 2019 he was named in Guyana's squad for the 2019 to 20 Regional Super 50 tournament. As of July 31, 2015, he was listed in the Damerara senior team to partake in the Guyana Cricket Board inter-county four-day competition where he will look to be a prolific scorer and make a claim for a second burst in first-class cricket. In the 2016 to 17 regional 4 day competition Chanderpol had the chance for several innings with his father in March 2017 the Chanderpols became the first father son partnership to both score 50s in the same first class innings since CK and CN Naidu in 1956 to 57 His fathership Darren had also made his first class debut for Guyana as a teenager When he was 18, Shiv Narin was playing the Bangladesh Premier League and was away during the course of his son's debut. Following his father's footsteps, young Taj Narin Brandon Chanderpool has been professed to become the leader of the next generation of West Indies batsmanship. An uncluttered mind first focus a considerably high backlift and the obvious left-handed approach continues to draw parallels with his father the son even hammers the bail onto the crease just like shiv narin he plays for guyana in first class cricket and made his first class debut in february 2013 at age 16 for guyana against leeward islands in the regional four day competition at sir vivian richards stadium in north sound as a prolific run scorer for guyana at youth level He earned a spot in the Windies squad for the 2014 under 90s World Cup held in the UAE. During the World Cup he scored an unbeaten 84 against Zimbabwe in Abu Dhabi. Chanderpaul's knock helped propel the Windies to an eventual 167 run win over the Zimbabweans. He then scored 93 against Canada to notch a consecutive man of the match award in a 67 run win.